Hey guys, James here today and welcome back to The Sims 4 Create a Sim Demo. Uh, so today I'm going to be trying to recreate a Luna from my Aluna... I was about to say my Aluna Island Let's Play. No, uh, recreating a Luna from my Island Paradise Let's Play. Uh, and of course, Aluna Island is named after her, so she's a pretty important character in my uh, my Let's Play history. So I thought I'd try and recreate her today, and we'll see how we go. So we need to change her overall look first of all, because she looks nothing like this. So no, not hair. Let's go face. Let's see if we can find one that's sort of similar. Uh, that nose is actually quite similar. That's pretty. That's actually probably a pretty good starting point. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go with that. That's that's pretty good. Pretty good starting point. Uh, as for skin tone, she has a little bit of a tan because she's an Islander girl. Uh, probably around... Mm, not quite that tone, but I think that's that's probably as close as we're going to get. That's, that's quite a good colour. Uh, right. Uh, ooh, skin details. Oh, she does actually have a beauty mark underneath her eye. Uh, she has... Yeah, about there. That's kind of actually where she has it. So there you go. Sweet. Uh, we got that in. Uh, I don't think she has any other. I think that's it. So that'll do us there. As for eyes, her eye colour is actually pretty much that. Although, oh, I was hoping there was a bit, a bit, be one a shade darker. Because her eyes... Oh, I don't know what's closer, that one or that one. Because her eyes are pretty much between these two colours. Probably that one. They're, they are darker rather than lighter. So those will be her eye colour there. So I'm just getting the basics down, obviously. And then we'll uh, head into more of her details later. So she's got uh, hair probably... That's a very, that's a very weird colour of hair. That's probably as close as it's going to be. So we're going to go like that, but we're going to make her bald. Just so we can see her head as we're working on her. Uh, actually, no, no, you know, you know what? We're not going to make her bald because that actually makes it harder. Because I, 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 don't, know what her, I don't know what her full face shape is. Now, let's see. Well, that's actually quite close to hairstyle. I mean, hers is more islandy. Is that? Mm, I don't know. I don't know what's going to be the closest to you. I wish you'd stop turning away. Look at me. Jesus. Uh, let's see. Uh, no. No, I think that one that, that was up before was probably the closest. Not that one. Uh, was Oh, God. What have I done with it now? Was it, oh, which one did I say was close? That one's kind of close. Uh, maybe, e I reckon either that one or this one. Probably the one before. Probably this one. Uh, it's a bit shorter at the back, though. I think that's going to be... That'll be alright. We can always change it later, isn't it? No... No worry there. Right, let's go to the face now. Uh, so for the nose, her the front of the nose looks pretty similar, but she's got a very flat nose. There might be a better, better sort of one to go with. Hang on, let's look from the front. Oops, sorry. Look from the front and let's choose a nose that's quite similar. Uh, sort of more one like that, but it's just a bit thinner. So I guess if maybe if we just choose that one. Uh, it's kind of, yeah, it's kind of like that from the side. It's a bit flatter though. So let's see. Probably, probably, that's probably a good starting point. So let's, let's jump a little bit closer on the nose here. Uh, so it's quite, so her nostrils are closer together than that. And they actually go up a little bit. Not quite that much. Probably about like that. Because uh, I've, got, I've got a whole bunch of pictures of her up. <laughs> of the original Luna up right now. So I can sort of have for reference. And try and get them pretty close. So they are up a little bit like that. Uh, the nose is fine from that angle. Uh, it's just this, the side is sort of more, more flat. Uh, can I bring that bridge out a bit? Because that would probably be better. That's actually looking pretty close already. Um, oh, not like that. The nose is, is pretty, is pretty spot on. Like, it's pretty close. Uh, I think, I'm, I'm pretty happy with that. We can always come back to it, of course. No, no worries there. Now, for the mouth, if we jump out of detail mode once more and go to the mouth, and let's just choose one that looks kind of similar. I mean, that's not too far off, but it's not as close as it could be, I don't think. Uh, so she's got quite a... Quite plump lips. Uh, definitely not like that. It, it sort of it comes down more in the middle. Uh, whatever you call that. I know, it I know it has an actual name, but I don't know what it's called. Uh, definitely not like those. Let's go back up the top. Uh, so it's kind of like... Pretty more like... Hmm. I don't know. It's kind of it's difficult. It's, it's difficult because the Sims and Sims 4 just look different to what they do in Sims 3. So it's kind of it's kind of difficult to because I'm trying to I'm trying to get like spot on here, but as you know, definitely not. These these are very pursed lips right there. 
She looks like she's very stern right there. She's like, oh, I'm so angry. <laughs> oh, dear. No, no. She's much more relaxed sort of looking lips. Um, I don't know. Uh, let's go. Let's go with sort of maybe those ones. Let's go with these and let's jump into detail mode and see what we can edit about them. So we can. Oh, jeez. <laughs> nope. Sort of like that. And then it comes up. She has a little bit of a smile. Not, <laughs> not quite that much. No, no. She has a little bit of a curve to her mouth, sort of like that. Uh, this one is sort of more like that-ish. The, there's not so much definition around the, the, t the top of the mouth, though, because whatever those lines are called, I can't remember. I know it has a name, and I totally know it. It starts with N, I'm pretty sure. It's like something, something lines. I don't know. It has a name. Uh, maybe it's not N. I don't know. Uh, hmm. Her mouth looks too... Oh, that's me a smile. Her mouth is too sort of small. Need to, can I drag it out to the sides? Oh, oh, there we go. That looks weird. That looks really weird, though. What's going on? She's got, like, monkey mouth happening now. Oh, oh, Jesus. <laughs> right, now bring that back out. Why is that? Her nose looks quite far up. She has quite a small face, actually. Can I bring her eyes down? I can. That just gives her a massive forehead, though. Bring her nose down. Um, can I, I can't bring the mouth up anymore. I guess that's probably pretty close. All right, let's... Uh, the mouth needs to be a little bit wider. Just a little bit. I can't seem to get it now. Why can't I... Why can't I drag it? I've got to look at it. I've got to adjust her profile, too. Uh, why can't I... Oh, so that's doing the smile. I don't want to do the smile. I want to make the mouth... Oh, there we go. About there, that's pretty good. Let's get a little smile going again. That's looking pretty good. Uh, her jaw, her chin needs to come down a little bit. It's got quite... Everything is really quite soft on her face. It's a very soft face. There's no sort of harsh... Any harsh lines or anything. Where's, uh... Where's makeup, actually? Can I... Skin details... Is it accessories? Uh, oh, pff, the one that says makeup. All right, let me take up all take up all the makeup so I can see what I'm actually dealing with here. Let me go to the side now. So the side of her face is uh, a little. The chin is sort of more in line with all of this. Can I bring the mouth back? I can. Sort of. Can I bring the nose back? I can make it even flatter. It's pretty much like that. Although her. F oh God. So the, the nose and the mouth and the chin are sort of all in line, pretty much. And then the forehead's look back a little bit, kind of like that, I think. So that's looking pretty good. Uh, cool. I think that's it's coming along quite nicely. Can I bring the sort of... I want to bring the sort of neck up a little bit there. No, that's doing something else. Ooh. <laughs> nope. Undo that. Uh, I don't know. I wanted to sort of tuck that in a little bit, but I don't think I can. All right, so let's go back to the front now. Let's keep let's keep looking at the front. Uh, can I make her face a little bit? It's, I think it's too wide. It's even more like that. Oh, actually, no, she does have quite a wide face. Her no, I think her nose needs to be a little bit wider. I'm I'm liking this. It's turning out well. Now let's just jump over to, jump over to her eyes. They're sort of her eyes are quite like they look quite large because her sort of eyelids are quite open. So if we, oh, oh no, I don't want to change your actual retina. I want to bring the, oh god, that looks, no, it's kind of like, uh, the side is up. The bottom is kind of, oh god, she looks like she's heavily squinting now. What have I done? Uh, and let's bring that down. Can I, can I rotate the eye or do I have to jump back out to do that? I think I have to jump out. Uh, let's scale. I don't want to scale it. Probably rotate it. Because I think that's what I did originally. I sort of rotated it. Eyes are very... She looks very, like... She looks very intense right now. Like, she's really shocked. I need to relax the eyes a little bit. That's looking a bit better. That, that's looking like a Luna to me. Uh, let me let me jump back out again. She still looks a bit like... Oh my god, what is going on in here? <laughs> she still looks a little bit shocked, actually. Let's bring that down a little bit more. Relax it a bit more. She's looking a little bit too shocked for my liking. Uh, let's go about there. That's a bit better. All right, eyebrows, eyebrow time now. Let's have a look. So she's got quite thinly plucked eyebrows. Well, not thinly, but sort of. They're very curvy. 
quite thin, nicely groomed. Maybe those ones. Oh, not quite like that. It's a little bit... Uh, that's looking pretty close. Maybe that one. Can I make them a little bit more... They just seem to blend in with the skin quite a lot, so it looks a bit weird. Uh, oh, I guess that's alright. Let's jump in. Let's give this a bit more of a curve, because she has quite curvaceous... Curvaceous eyelids. Oh, eyelids? Eyebrows is what I meant to say. Uh... I think, no, they need, they need to come down just in height. No, I don't want to rotate. Is that just moving? Oh, that's sort of dragging them all. Uh, that's way too close to the eye. That looks a bit weird. Sort of about there-ish. Her eyes, her, I don't know, her eyes, I'm not feeling the eyes. Uh, let me jump back into these real quick. They see, I think the, no, not, the eyelid needs to be leaned over that way a bit. That looks better. Because it's sort of higher on the, this sort of, the, in the middle. And then low on the uh, the right hand side, and quite flat at the bottom. Let me jump out again. I think that's looking better. That's definitely looking better. It's look it's looking like a lunar to me. Hey, look, it's a lunar. <gasps> oh, I should probably say her name as well. Uh, a lunar, Ellis. There we go. That was her name. That's looking pretty good. All right, stop smiling. You're not. Don't don't be so happy about yourself. Um. The fact I'm I'm pretty happy with that. I mean, I'm not a master creator sim, or I'm not a master at creating sims, but I'm thinking that looks pretty close to me. Like as close as I personally think I'm gonna get it. <laughs> so I think that's pretty good. Let's go. Uh, Cause I'm yeah. The eye. Let me let me just sort of double check. Eyebrows are looking good. Eyes are definitely the same sort of shape. Nose is looking good. It could probably if I could get the tip a little bit rounder. I don't think I can, because it just looks a little bit pointy. So it just needs to be more round. Let me bring those down a bit. Like that. I think that, is that a bit better? I think that's a bit better now. Uh, oh, definitely not on the side though. What's happened there? Sort of, sort of curved down. Um, can I... Is that better? Is it sort of, yeah, that's better. That, yeah, that's better. That's, that's better than it was before. Uh, although I think the, the nostrils need to sort of come in a little, little bit. I just need to be higher than the nose. Or maybe it's just the angle that we're sort of the pictures are taking at. That's all right. Yeah, that that's looking good. Okay, I think I'm pretty happy with the face. Uh, let me let me double check over the hair again because the other option was this one. Uh, it's a little too it, it's too flat. It needs to be more buffy. She's got very buffy hair, so that's why that one was a good choice. Uh, and then. No, that's definitely not. I'm not feeling a lure on that one. That one. I think that was the other one I was looking at before. That one's pretty good. I'm going to go with that one. That I feel like that's a Luna. That, that's her style. Um, right. So, clothes. I guess it's... Uh, oh, makeup, actually. We'll chuck on her makeup as well. She likes a bit of makeup. She likes to look fabulous. Uh, how do I... I haven't actually done makeup in this yet. So, cheeks. I want to go... Oh, there's only one option. All right. Get a bit of color into your cheeks, girl. And some nice lipo. She has quite a quite a dark sort of color, not that dark, more muted. Hmm. I don't think they have quite the sort of tone I'm after. Cause she she's not she's not exactly a girly girl. She's kind of like a she's kind of a cool islander chick if that makes sense. Ooh, not quite like that. That that's that screams more date night than sort of daily lip color. Uh, I'm thinking that one there looks all right. It needs to be a bit darker though. It's just, I don't know. Let's just go with that one. Oh, actually, well, let's have a look at these ones. That's probably a good idea. Nah, maybe some of these might be right. No, nope. These are too shiny. These are like shiny lips. Right, let's go back to this one. Yeah, that will be fine. Uh, and then we need a bit of eyeliner to sort of give a bit of definition to her. She just sort of has a, like a regular kind of eyeliner. Uh. Can I make it, like, not so black as a grey, but, oh, it's, like, way too bright now. Alright, well, we'll just go like that. That looks about right to me. Not as close as it's gonna be. The lip colour's a bit off, but that looks like a Luna to me! Nice. Alright, she does actually have a tattoo as well. Uh, if I can remember how to do those, I think I have to go... No, 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 jump back out. I think it's, uh, body tattoos. Right, she has a little tattoo on her, on her left shoulder of a, of a mermaid. Oh, you can get a dolphin, but if that was on the shoulder, that'd be perfect. Do they? Oh. 
What's having that different tattoos on the on the shoulders? The one on the but oh, I can't see that. Take that off. Uh, let's. I don't know. I have a dolphin. Let's give her a dolphin on her ankle, uh, and then maybe this one on her arm because that's kind of islandy. Yeah, that'll do. All right. Uh, now let's go for her top. Uh, I've got I've got sort of like a little. I'm gonna try and get similar clothing, but it's definitely never gonna be the same, is it? Um, Oh, hello! Put some pants on, Aluna. Jesus. She had a little skirt on. A uh, little islandy skirt. Maybe something like that. Yeah, okay. Where's a... Hang on. Oh, whoopsies. Sort of jumped out of the game there for a second. By accident. Uh, bottoms. Uh, we want to go skirts. I'm just trying to pull up her outfit that she wears. Alright, so it's sort of like a maroon sort of skirt. Kind of... Oh, no, definitely not. I was going to say kind of that color, but definitely not. No, not red. Is there anyone that sort of matches? No. I think this is probably going to be the best skirt here. Uh, not a brown. Maybe like that. Because that's a similar color to what her top was, so maybe if we flip the colors and mix her up a little bit, get the top uh, sort of the color of what the skirt's supposed to be. Uh, so she needs a sort of just an airy kind of top. So, have something comfortable. Go to the beach and, you know, just chill out. Uh, although you can't swim in The Sims 4, so that's kind of irrelevant. But you know, you know what I mean. Uh, none of those colors are what I really want. Uh, maybe this one has a, a, a decent color. Red, no. It's more of a... Definitely more of a maroon color I'm after. Uh, isn't that like filter items colors? No, maroon. Damn it. <laughs> uh, okay. Forget that. Let's go for maybe this one. No, she's definitely not not supposed to be loud. It's supposed to be a comfortable, casual sort of wear. Mm. It's not dark enough. It's too. It's too bright. It's like too it's too sort of flashy. It's maybe some, comfortable, casual, comfortable, casual. I don't want to spend all day choosing a shirt here. <laughs> maybe we just go with one of these sort of muted colors, sort of pastel. Uh, that's alright actually, that looks good, except well, obviously not the boots. Let's change those. Uh, she was just wearing kind of sandaly type things, kind of similar to this. Somewhat similar to that, but let's change the colour. Uh, maybe some, maybe that colour? Because that goes with their top? I don't know. I think that's alright. That looks like a Luna to me! Except her clothes don't match at all to what she had in The Sims 3, but you know, <laughs> you can only do so much with what we have. Right, formal wear. Uh, I do actually have pictures of her outfits uh, somewhere. Oh, there's her formal wear. Okay. Let's go full body. Uh, I guess kind of something similar to that. Can I also take off that? There we go. Uh, it was like that, but sort of purpley color. A bit darker than that. Why is her hair changed? <laughs> let's, go, let's go change her hair as well. Uh, she, had, she had the same hair. In her, in her formal, so what did I chuck on her? That one. Yeah, let's also make sure her hair is the same in all the others. Nope, keeps changing. All right, let's uh, let's set her hair in all of these first. Uh, that one. Parties. I, I might actually mix up her hair in a bit, so maybe when she's working out, she'll have it tied up. That might be a good idea. That's all right. That looks pretty good. So she'll have it tied up when she works out. Uh, when she goes to bed. No, she's getting the same hairstyle. Parties. Oh, she should do it up. Make it look really fancy. Maybe go for a nice nice brush through it. Uh, or maybe... Maybe comb it back. Oh, that's braided it. <laughs> uh, no, where's the one that's like a sort of... Not comb back, I don't know what it's called. Uh, this one. Oh, this one, sorry. She could, she could go with that, she could pull that off. Maybe she'll go with that for parties and then she'll sleep in that. Work out in that and then formal in a... Sort of that kind of color there. A uh, color? The hairstyle. Right, back to clothes. Let's do that again. Yeah, that's actually fine for formal, not the shoes though. Let's mix up the shoes. Uh, let's go for... She had kind of shoes like this one. They're sort of pinky shoes to match. Because that's pretty much what she's wearing in the other one. I mean, obviously the dress is not the same. Uh, I didn't actually change the, her body in this at all, but I think that's probably fine. It looks, it looks like a... In my opinion, in my humble opinion, it looks like a Luna. And I created a Luna, so I say what looks like a Luna. All right? Got it? Good. Uh, workout gear. What did she wear for that? Sort of just a uh, a top kind of like... 
probably like that. And it was just white. Yep. And then she had some some sort of leggings on. I know you can do leggings in this actually. Can I take off pants and then just put on leggings? Yeah, that's good. I like that you can do that. Uh, it will kind of like a, a grayish green. Definitely neither of those colors. None of those colors. Maybe just go for a gray. Oh, but it did have a, it did have a highlight of green in there. Uh, no, let's not go for, maybe these ones would be better because they're more sort of workout orientated. Let's go for that one because it's got this sort of green stripe on the side. That looks pretty good. Uh, and then socks. No, let's go shoes. Uh, and she just had sort of white joggers on, something like that. Yeah. Let's give her some socks with it as well so she doesn't get, uh, no, no athletic socks? I don't want athletic socks. I just want regular socks. Oh, that's boots. No wonder. Uh, <laughs> alright, socks. There you go. She is ready to work out. Oh, yeah. Looking good. Aluna looking good. All right, sleepwear. Uh, she just had a comfortable little nighty on, more or less, which they don't have in this, so, uh, I guess she just wear a comfortable top. Uh, it's kind of like a peach color. Yeah, like that. That's good. And then for undergarments, uh, it's not quite the same color. That's kind of annoying. Uh, but let's take off shoes. I don't really want you to wear shoes. You weren't really wearing, she wasn't wearing anything. She just had bare feet. Oh, there's a little dolphin. Very nice. Looking good. And party wear, which didn't exist in uh, Sims 3. So let's just give her something party-ish. That's actually kind of good. I like that. Let's just change the color though. Something more fun. Uh, yeah, that's a nice color. I like that. And then the skirt. Uh, what's that one? I like that one actually. That looks a bit more looks a bit more fun, a bit more out there. Uh, maybe go for that one. Yeah, that's all right. Okay, and shoes. Go for some <laughs> go for some monster boots. No, let's go with uh, let's go with those. I think that's what she had on before. Uh, maybe bright red shoes. I don't know. It's just party wear. I don't know. A Luna. <laughs> oh, a Luna. Uh, I guess we could adjust your body a little bit. Oh, jeez. Oh, that's so gross. When you make them like super skinny and then you can see all their bones and stuff through there. Ooh. Uh, now she's gonna be. A she's definitely gonna be average. Maybe a little bit fitter. Fitter than your average person. Oh, just sort of average. That's all right. Uh, traits. I have no idea what her traits were actually because I don't think I. Uh, I didn't get a screenshot of her traits. I don't know what they were. I'm sure some of you remember. Uh, but I know who she was. She she liked to own everything. She liked to be entrepreneur. She was definitely after fortune. That's her aspiration. Um, and she... Fabulously wealthy or... The Sim is all about owning the biggest, fanciest home. She did like her big home. But I think she's probably... She just wants to have... Uh, no, she wasn't. She wasn't career driven. She she just owned loads of properties. Let's just go. She wants a big mansion. Uh, now her traits. She's definitely going to be uh, wherever ambitious is. Ambitious. She's definitely ambitious. Materialistic. Mm, I wouldn't say that. She 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 just wanted to buy loads of places, and she was sort of passionate about that. She was quite. Uh, she wasn't really romantic. <laughs> she was when she wanted to be. Uh, She's a genius because she she is a, she has a self-made fortune, uh, and she uh, is a a perfectionist as well. Uh, and that will do. That's a, that's a Luna Ellis. Uh, oh, actually no, I always forget these bits here. Let's give her a walk style. I, oh, definitely. Yes, that is that is a Luna right there. <laughs> the snooty walk, definitely. <laughs> that is a Luna. All right, that's her walk style. Uh, what does she sound like? Yeah, that's her there. Alright, so that is Aluna Ellis. Uh, I will put her up on the gallery as well, so if you guys have the cast demo, you can download her and customize her and change her up if you want. Uh, but there we go! I've created Aluna Ellis uh, in The Sims 4. We may possibly use her in a Let's Play in the future. Uh, but yeah, guys, thank you for watching this uh, creator sim of Aluna Ellis. I will see you next time, and have an awesome day.